Hey, neighbor, we're on Ed Watch tonight. Candidate for Governor Gina Raimondo says she helped bring back Narragansett beer to Rhode Island. But some say she's putting a pretty thick head on that glass. NBC10 political reporter Bill Rapley is live in the studio now with what he's found out tonight. Bill. Well, Gene, she sure did pick a favorite brand. It kind of reminds me of when Mirth York made a bid to buy Newport Creamery. But Raimondo's claim is that she helped the new owners revive the revered brand. Remember what Narragansett beer used to mean to Rhode Island? She picked a popular Rhode Island brand for this one, popular and reminiscent of the good old days when the state was still a manufacturing powerhouse and unemployment was not everyone's biggest concern. It's definitely an upbeat ad. This is a comeback story. Uh, she, she helped turn around Narragansett beer. She wants to turn around Rhode Island, and that's what we need right now. We need a comeback, right? Rhode Island needs a comeback. But is what she claims true? It appears to be her former investment firm, Point Judith Capital, certainly helped out numerous companies, which reportedly add up to a thousand jobs. But back to Narragansett beer. Is it misleading at all, though, when when the beers brewed for the most part out no, of state? No, the 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 company is, you know, again, it's, it's an iconic Rhode Island brand. They're headquartered here in here in Providence. They employ Rhode Islanders just down the street. Now it's true that Narragansett beer is not brewed in Rhode Island currently, but its headquarters are here in the Jewelry District in Providence. And the man who co-founded the new Narragansett Brewery Company, Mark Hellendrung, is not in town today. But he did give us a statement saying that the revival of Narragansett beer was made made possible with the help of many dedicated people, including Gina Raimondo. And he hopes soon to have all Narragansett beer brewed in Rhode Island. So Gina's not brewing beer, and Narragansett Brewery doesn't employ a thousand workers. But the ad doesn't say that, and the claims it does make add up. I'm Gina Raimondo. That company president, Mark Hellendrung, says once the brewing operation moves to Rhode Island, there will be a few dozen jobs created. Now, Raimondo resigned from the venture capital firm back when she was elected treasurer. I'm Bill Rapley, NBC10 News, in the studio.